Bluegrass then, well, they have the legit full face helmet already in their lineup, as used by the Scott World Cup downhill team. So, where does that leave a helmet like the Vanguard? I think to me, the characteristic needs to be slightly different. Um, as an example, an enduro helmet, we are looking for a little bit more airflow, uh, breathability. Obviously, you're going to wear a helmet for a long period as we're racing for five, six hours during the day. So, maybe a little bit more lightweight as well. I spoke with Martin to see what he'd choose between the two helmets in the full face lineup. I think it's all gonna depend to the terrain, the temperature of the events, you know. If we have more races, uh, lift access, I might go for the legit uh, for more protection. But if we have a very hot race, uh, more pedally or longer day on the bike, then I might orient myself to the Vanguard helmets, which provide more airflow and uh, breathability. 